My name is Elijah Garcia, and I'm a patrol officer with the Rear Rancho Police Department. Every day is different. You wake up in the morning, you put on your uniform, and you drive to the station, and you don't know what the day has for you. You don't know what you're going to run into, um, and that's what, I, that's what I love about it. My name is Officer Dylan Glenn, Rear Rancho Police Department, assigned to patrol division and the SWAT team as well. It's a smaller city, but we're still the third largest population-wise out of New Mexico and it's constantly growing, um, so we, we always need new people to, to go along with that constantly growing population. My first name is Jacqueline. I'm a sergeant in the patrol division. We moved to Rio Rancho in 1985, and the reason that we came and stayed um, was because we knew that the, the police force meant business, and it was a good education system out here. I would call them leaders in the community. You see them out, you see them at functions, you see them at community events, you see them involved, and you see them uh, giving back as well and doing things for others. I'm glad that I live in Rio Rancho. I'm glad that I'm here with this police department. I mean, they risk their lives every day. My name is Justin Rankin. Supervise the dispatchers and call takers while they take non-emergency and emergency lines. Dispatch out paramedics and police officers to calls. We're kind of their lifeline on the other side of the radio, so we make sure that they get all the information they need when they're headed out to a call, make sure that they're safe. We got your back just as much as you guys have each other's back out in the field. We have it just as much in here. My name is Phil Gagos. I'm a police officer in the patrol division of the Rancho Police Department. Uh, as a new cadet, this police department it's, it's wonderful. Everybody here has been so supportive and open to questions. And as I learn and I ask questions, everybody's there to help you out. Everybody's here to back you up. And it's, it's just wonderful. It's something new every day. Um, and the people that I work with are awesome. It was important to me to, to do something that, that gave back, that helped out in, in some way or another. Um, I've always wanted to be a police officer and I wanted to protect the streets that my family walks on every day. My name is Richard Kishadi. I'm the Sergeant Over Property Crimes Unit with the Rio Rancho Police Department. It, it's a great feeling to know that when you have a victim of a crime that you're able to um, help them through the process. When you bring that case in front of the courtroom and the suspects are held accountable for their actions, um, it's definitely, you could see the relief in the victim's face and knowing that you're doing good work and you are doing things that are helping the community as a whole, it's a great experience. We are very blessed. We, we have a community that respects us and an administration that cares deeply for us, citizens that, you know, that have our best interest in mind and who also work for the same mission. So I think that really helps weed out a lot of the, the problems that other, you know, other cities have. To me, as a mother and a citizen and someone who's lived in this community for 14 years, um, I feel like they really do a really good job providing safety and a sense of assurance to everyone who lives here. As a cadet, we're looking for people who can hold themselves to a high standard, who are willing to put forth the effort for themselves and the community they serve, in, for the other officers that they're serving with. Once you are here and once you've decided to take upon that mantle upon you, then you will find that you have a lot of support amongst your fellow officers, but when we're on the job, we're always there for each other, and that's about as significant a thing as you can get in this job, I would say. I feel it's, it's more, it's a vocation. I'm dedicated, I'm passionate about um, policing the, this city and um, you know I, I just I can't imagine doing it anywhere else. <laughs>